What's that one? Could it be? Oh my god, is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? It's so shrill. It is shrill. It's the shrill card. Hello. All right. Have I got a treat for you? Check this out. I found it on the way up. Well, it wasn't actually. It was, there was a broken glass bottle. I was like, what's that lovely green glass? And then I realised it's a rose chafer. A what? Rose chafer. A little beetle that actually I think is quite a pest a lot of the time, but too lovely. What, what does it do? I don't really know. <laughs> Right, we're going to Wales, to Newport, um, Newport Levels, which is an RSPB reserve, because I've had reports that shrill cardabies are there. Uh, Sh uh, what? Shrill cardabie. What's that? Um, shrill cardabie is one of, if not the rarest bee. It's quite, it's got quite a wide range all through southern England, but it's very, very localised. Um, in terms of their appearance, a shrill cardabie looks very much like any other bumblebee to probably yours, my, and any other untrained eye. So how are we going to find them? <laughs> um, a lot of the help is going to be that they have a shrill buzz. So I think it's like this. They're kind of an all over dusty colour. Uh, they, but between their wing base they've got a kind of black circle and they've got a band that goes down their rump as well. So that would be quite cool if we can find one and I'd visually identify it and give more of an idea as to what it actually looks like. Oh, there's a bee. Oh, that's good. That's the first bee of the day. I think it's a white-tailed one. Oh, there's an orchid there. Yes! What have you got there? That's not a mini beast, actually. It's an orchid. It's not a boy, is it? I don't know. I'm trying to, trying to hear if it sounds shrill. See. Ow, mother... Oh, that's the first sting of the day. Nettles in here. What people think of as bees when they draw a cartoon bee, it was like black and yellow stripes, which is more like bumblebees. My knee's on fire. Sting, stingy sting. Oh, oh, oh! That one. Are you serious? I'm trying to listen to it. Where's it gone? There, there. Do you see it? No, which one is it? So do we think that bee you saw was the shrill carder? I actually don't think it was. Um, having reviewed pictures, it was very clearly banded, isn't it? That one that we saw wasn't. But it's quite lovely in here. I could, I'm, I'm trying not to crush too much. I've been stuck in this one area for a long time, both so as not to crush, but also because if you just sit and watch, I don't know if they're coming across like there, but the bees just come to you. It's great. I've actually found one. No. If it's not, then I don't... It's got the banding. So what do we think it is then? Right, I think it's actually a brown banded carder, which is Bombus humilis, not Bombus sylvarum, which is We've what we're looking for. We've been a bit humiliated. Let's go. Bees, man. Is that one? Stop it. But is it? So I think the thing that we've been looking at actually is not even a bombus because it's not fluffy and it's got like that distinct sort of honeybee-esque banding because you said you thought it was a honeybee. So I think it's probably an Andrina of some description. Denticulata, I think there's one called. Let's go tell them the news. <laughs> There's a bee. What is that? We've not seen one of those. It's very ginger, isn't it? I think it's, it's got band. That's humilis. That's humilis. Is that humilis? Yes. Yes, definitely. Stay still, humilis. That is, yeah, that is just like. It's Bombus humilis. So that is. There it goes. Sister species to um, Savarum, which is what we're looking for. So it's a Carder bee, but it's not the Carder bee. Not shrill. Yeah. That feels like we're getting closer. Yeah. Yeah, so brown-bounded tick, which is good, because 
from the various sort of things that we've read, we've seen that brown banded and shrill carders were both here. So the fact we've seen one is like, ah, yes, this isn't a completely wasted trip. I just want to get the, the absolute money shot. I want to get a shot and when I take it, like money to fall out of the camera. Plenty more bees in the sea. <laughs> How's it going? Um, here's a thought. If you only like bees as an entomologist, are you a vegan? <laughs> Look at that. Oh, wind. I don't want to cause alarm to other nature watchers, but this is bouncy. And these tubes are wobbly as well, so that's quite sick. Kiss me, kiss me. <laughs> Come to mummy. Come to daddy. Hello, B. Good things come to those who wait. Yes. Is that the money shot? Maybe. It's a classic shot here of Callum stalking, <laughs> stalking the beehives. <laughs> These bees are doing my head in. Although I say in that now, like that's because we've been walking around looking for a bee for ages. I don't know if I'm just getting frustrated with it. What's that one? Could it be? Oh my God. Mate, is it? Is it? Is it? Is it? It's so shrill. It is shrill. It's the shrill card. So just talking just now about how satisfying it would be, we've actually finally found one. Yes, listen to its high pitch. Yeah, with its ginger bum. Oh my word. It does sound shrill. It sounds like a fly. It does, doesn't it? I actually can't believe it. That is it. It's yeah, it definitely is. No, it's got the ginger rump as well and it's sort of yellowy tinge. I'll top it. There's loads of ants here. Yeah, mate. I'll take the bite for the beast. That's, How do you feel? I'm very pleased. Aren't you? This is probably the rarest thing I've ever seen in the UK. Genuinely. Yeah. Well, what's exciting is that it's just there buzzing around. And, and I mean, there's not many people passing, but it's just like you would be completely oblivious unless you were looking for this, which I think is why insects are so interesting, because they're so small, but they do surround us all the time. And then sometimes ones like this one that's buzzing around now are actually just really awesome to find. That's the man who's seen a shrill. Huh? Um, I'm elated. Ah, uh, lovely. They had no bees. <laughs> Yeah, that we thought, oh yeah, no, we'll go to the RSPB reserve, we'll get ourselves some bees, like some pins, we'll wear them. That'll fit in nicely, but yeah, no bees. Idiots. RSP. <laughs> Great day, honestly. We saw it, didn't we? I didn't. You were quite optimistic, but I thought we were going to go out today and spend the whole day looking for a bee that we weren't going to find and then have to make a crap video without a bee in it. Instead, we're just going to make a crap video with a bee in it. Uh, with Shrill Carder, it's the test. Find the bee that has a high-pitched buzz. Trying to make up the rest. Hello, bee. 